Okay, uh, so things didn't go according to plan. Apparently my friend thought I was coming in tomorrow. Fortunately, I managed to change my flight and tomorrow morning I'll be flying up to Vail. I'm definitely having my doubts at this point because I've spent a lot of money on flights and a lot of money on Ubers and a lot of money on hotel rooms. Fingers crossed it works out. If it does, I'm sure I'll be shredding the mountain and I'll get to see some really cool things and meet some really awesome people. One thing I've learned is if you're ever kind of feeling down, try and find a place to rest your head, go to sleep, wake up, tomorrow's a new day, you'll feel a lot better. I have to go to the airport at nine o'clock in the morning and I'll be in Vail, Colorado in the afternoon. But for now, I'm gonna get some sleep. My name is Ryan. I'm a photographer and filmmaker from the UK. This December, I quit my job to pursue a new goal, to have the most exciting adventures, meet the coolest people, and prove that you can do the same if you wish. Armed with a camera, surfboard, and one-way ticket, the road ahead is sure to be a wild ride. Follow along as the adventure unfolds. Okay, so today is a new day. We're in Denver, Colorado airport. Had a great night's sleep. Gonna attack this full force, figure out where I'm going, find out the lay of the land, and hopefully get situated on a new adventure. Okay, so I made it to the airport in Vail, Colorado. Next stop is to try and get to Beaver Creek. The shuttle is 50 bucks, so I'm gonna try and take the Eagle County bus. I have no idea what I'm doing, no idea where I'm going. Hopefully I can navigate and find my way to where I need to be. a lot of lows and I nearly bailed on this whole scenario. So I'm gonna be here for the next six weeks working in the kitchen and learning to snowboard. It's been a long time since I've worked in a kitchen so we'll see how that goes on. Seems like everyone I've met has been super friendly. I'm really excited to be working here and the environment's incredible. It's kind of crazy. I'm living in this hotel suite. I got really lucky because it's really hard to find accommodation here. I'm super tired. I'm gonna go to bed. I've got an early start tomorrow. That's the other thing. I've got about an hour commute, maybe a little bit less to get to work. Bye bus. for the second time ever. Red buffalo laps all day. Got my second badass woman instructor, <laughs> Nicole. First one was Connor. We got all the gear and no idea. Done it. <laughs> all good. 